guys, how you doing? Welcome. This is Angelo Bass. I hope you guys are having a wonderful time. New Year is here. It's upon us. And I'm sorry for this late review. I mean late review. <laughs> late reading. Um, so yeah, I promised myself that I was gonna you're gonna see my sexy ass face. I mean, come on. I am a sexy ass guy. Uh, you won't be disappointed, I promise. <laughs> But no, yeah, I wanted to show my face more so you guys can actually have more of a personal like um, reading, you know, see me, see my reactions. You know, I love, I love reacting because I'm an actor. Anyways, so yeah, we're going to get into the reading for Gemini for January. Happy New Year. Geminis, you know, we've been through a lot of Geminis. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, by the way, UCF representing my school. So... Let's see what's happening for gem and gem gemmy gems. My gemmy gems, okay? Remember, these are timeless reading, guys. Um, it may have happened, um, it could be happening, or it could, it could possibly come as an outcome for your future. So I try to connect to all the Geminis that are watching all over the world. I'm not gonna be able to connect to everybody. Sometimes these readings may not, you know, be for you. Maybe not all the messages are for you, but some of the messages for you. And sometimes it could be just a personal to somebody that needs to hear it. So on that note, let's see what connecting to Gemini's. Ooh, ooh, Gemmies, what's happening here? What is happening, my Gemini's, you know? So... I know personally because I'm a Gemini, so of course, you know, I have to pay homage to, to me because, you know, we special Gemin, Gemmy Gems, you know, Geminis, you guys are true gems. Uh, you need to understand that you are enough, okay? You are enough to to be something more than you, that you ever want to be, okay? Don't let anyone tell you that, you know, it's impossible. You know, we live in a in a time where things opportunities are all around us we just got to take the chance and take the risk and that's what this reading is all about because um the wedding came out so the wedding ring so i'm getting married possible connection um what i'm getting from this card is that um i'm sensing that some of the gemini's that have, have not been in your connection anytime soon um, they're going to be entering into a union. Um, it could be marriage proposal. It could also, like I said, I have to be, you know, I have to make sure that, you know, this has to stay general. Okay. Reading is supposed to be general. It's a general love reading, focusing on everything else. But whatever comes out, this card's message is for Gemini. It's for this month. So in January, I feel like um, you're going to start, you know, you're going to open yourself up to more opportunities for love. Because I feel like, just like me, you know, it's been hard to find love um, because we had to first find ourselves, um, realize our own worth sometimes. And from my personal experience, I really do think that um, self-growth is most important, just like self-love is so important. You're all your indulgence, you know, self-care. And I think that's what you prepared yourself for. You prepared to, to enter in a union that is is worthy of you that you you're worthy of this okay gemini you are sorry it's a little bit longer but sorry gemini but yeah you're worthy just to let you know you are worthy to be you deserve love gemini and you do i mean you're a true gem you know a lot of people say a lot of bad things about gemini's but you know what gemini's are true to themselves they're very effective communicators they're they're literally like you, you could just easily tell what a Gemini is just by looking at them, you know their true intentions, who they are, you know what what makes you who you are, you know Gemini, and that's what also the sna the girl the snake came out as well. So it's about making sure that you don't take people don't take advantage of your good nature, and I think that's the problem with Gemini is that they're misdiagnosed. A lot of people miss. Um, representation of what a Gemini really is. Gemini's a gen. Gemini's are true gems of the zodiac. Okay, there's no other sign in the zodiac that is more efficient than a Gemini, and because they take a lot of stuff, they take a lot of heat. 
because people believe that like, you know, we're two face or like we're two personas. And it, it is true. We have two, you know, two people living within us, a man, a feminine and a masculine. And we have a very dominant sign and very commutative of our communication. But sometimes people take, perceive that as weakness and it's not. It's actually because we're truly, we're, we're truly genuine to whatever. So every Gemini is truly genuine to who they are. Okay. And also remember, um, you know, it's okay to forgive, but never forget what that person made you feel. And that's what's a stab in the back. So somebody could be coming around, um, inflicting pain again, um, a life lesson. I think most Geminis have already learned all their life lessons. And so now I think starting this year is going to be a more swift into your abundance. And really, it's all about taking chances, you know, hand of the card. It's really time to really absorb yourself, you know, to really, truly understand that you deserve anything that you want in your life. There's nothing that you can't do that, you know, starts with you. So, I, Page of Wands came out, but I flipped it over because it wasn't really a thing. Because the thing is, Gemini, you are a true star. This is your mutual feelings right now. Um, you're about to receive a wish, fulfillment, and it's been a long time coming. It's about realizing that um, you are this true, genuine star, that a star has been born. <laughs> so you guys could be also ex experiencing a lot of um, promote, like a lot of success in career, um, business opportunities. I feel like you're going to grow. Like, some of you Geminis that I'm connected to, you guys are going to be superstars. Like, I don't know what it is for every Gemini. Maybe you're a superstar in your career. Like, you, you could be like, for me, um, I'm going to, my career is going to go up um, because I have such great positivity. And that's the thing, too. You have to always see the better things in life, you know. We know this world is, is a very cruel world, okay. But don't let that world change who you are stay true to yourself and follow the path and always find the positive things in life because you know what the more we dwell on the negative the more you're going to get a, dwell, a negative outcome okay so you might as well just you know suck it up and just move along forward charging forward so yeah you're you're turning into this thing because you've walked away from a very difficult cycle i think a lot of you guys have closed off a very difficult uh closing cycle um, that needed to be close. Um, it could be a, a ex. Um, it could be, you know, family members. Like, you guys closed off a lot of difficult cycles. Because you realize that it wasn't serving your higher good. It wasn't really giving you what you needed. You needed nutrients, Gemini. You're true gem. You need to surround yourself with greatness. You need to surround yourself with people that are going to fuel your fire. Not e extinguish it. So that's why, um, yeah, the Nine of Cups and the Queen of Swords in the bottom of the deck and then the Page of Wands, which is funny. So yeah, you're going to you're gonna get a new opportunity coming to you. Like new life is going to be breathed into you this year. I'm telling you, your worries are going to be gone away, Gemini. There's nothing to worry about this new year. And that's actually, a, that's a, like, don't get me wrong. You're going to be experiencing certain things all the time because you have to always stay consistent, you know, Stay consistent and um, motivate yourself to keep on going the distance, okay? You're going to always learn those lessons, those life lessons that you're going to always constantly learn. But I pretty much Gemini, so what I'm getting is that you've learned a lot of everything that you need to, to master yourself. You have mastery of self and you did it. And now because, because the, universe is, is under, the universe realized that you have learned everything and you stay true to yourself whole time guess what the universe is blessing you with a gift and it could be this romantic you know i'm really seeing a lot of things um because i'm still trying to stay general as i possibly can but i'm really seeing a person so the universe is blessing you with a person that knows you that knows your worth that truly sees you for what you are and who you are so let's continue um getting the cards Okay, this was sideways, but I'll take it this way. 
<laughs> the three of cups. So yeah, um, it's really building these nostalgic, all these, like everything that you've gone through has prepared you for this moment that you're about to, because you're, you're about to start a new, a new, a new you. Like, I'm telling you, your worries are gone. Your worries are going to be gone. 